One of the first real effects you'd notice would be that GPS satellites would stop working correctly. The satellites would stay in roughly the same orbits, but the incredibly precise timing and synchronization between ground stations and satellites would be ruined within hours. Most other clocks would keep working fine. However, if you have a very precise pendulum clock, you might notice something odd. By the end of the day, it would be three seconds ahead of where it should After be. After a month, the Earth would have expanded by 26 kilometers, an increase of 0.4%. Surface gravity would also only have gone up 0.4%, even though the Earth's mass would have increased by 1.2%. Surface gravity is proportional to radius, which is because as the planet grows, it gets more massive, but you also get further away from the middle. You wouldn't notice this difference in weight even using a scale. Human body weights vary by much more than 0.4% over the course of a day, let alone a month, and gravity itself varies by this much between different cities. What you would notice is the expansion. You'd see lots of cracks opening up in long concrete structures and the failure of elevated roads and old bridges. Most buildings would probably be okay, although those anchored firmly into bedrock might start to behave unpredictably. After a year, gravity would be 5% stronger, and the ground underneath structures would have expanded by 5%. You would probably notice the weight gain, and you would definitely notice the failure of roads, bridges, power lines, satellites, and undersea cables. Your pendulum clock would now be ahead by five days. After five years, gravity would be 25% stronger. If you weighed 70 kilograms when the expansion started, you'd weigh 88 now. Most of our infrastructure would have collapsed. The cause would be the ground expanding by 25%, not the increased gravity.